waka rebo da ima ne kem tegemea yeso tegemea tegemea salama be la atari tegemea tegemea mokozi yesu tegemea tegemea salama be la atari Happy Sabbath Church. Kanisa hamjambo. Ah, uh, tunapenda kuwalika kwa ajili ya ibada iliyo mbele yetu na kwa ajili ya kwanza ibada hiyo naomba sote tuweze kusimama na wimbo wa nambari 205 205 Kwa na Yesu Four, 204 right 204 tuimbe huo wimbo tunapoanza 204 Baba yetu na Mungu wetu wewe ulie ya sisi familia tunasimama mbele zako mchana huu kushukuru kwa sababu ya mpango ulio nao hapa mbele yetu baba yetu naomba ya kwamba uweze kushuka uweze kuwa miongoni mwetu tuelekeze tushuhudie mibaraka yako tunapoanza hata tutakapomaliza ninaomba haya kwa imani katika jina la Yesu aliye bwana na mkombozi wetu amen amen Asante sana karibuni nyote kwa ajili ya ibada hii iliyo mbele yetu. Nataka kuchukua muda mfupi tu kwa ajili ya kuwatambua na kuwakaribisha wote ambao wanashiriki uh, ibada hii pamoja nasi. Uh, tunavojua tunayo harusi kwa ajili ya uh, ndugu Oscar pamoja na dada Rexavin na kwa sababu hiyo uh, kuna marafiki na familia wale ambao wameweza kufika kushuhudia hafla hii. Kwa hivyo uh, napenda kwa ajili ya uh, familia na marafiki waliokuja kwa upande wa uh, ndugu Oscar Kambona niweze kukaribisha mzee pamoja na uh, upande huo wa familia yote wale walio miongoni mwetu tuweze kusimama kisha ataweza kutusalimu kwa ajili yao. 
Amen. Karibuni sana, karibuni sana. Uh, kwa ajili ya familia dada Rexavin, namkaribisha mzee uh, Benson pamoja na wote wa upande huo, butu salimu. Amen. Karibuni sana uh, wote wa shiriki uh, wa makanisa katika district hii, marafiki wale ambao umeza kufika pamoja na dugu wenzetu wanafunzi kutoka langata. Tunakaribisha sote kwa jumla tuweza kufeel uh, welcome na japo si ya kutaja labda moja kwa moja jameni ujisikie umekaribishwa katika ibada iliyo mbele yetu. Kwa hivyo wakati huu napenda kumkaribisha uh, kuwatambua tu wale ambao wako hapa. Tuko na uh, mzee uh, Eric Oseko yuko hapa. Tuko na Pastor Kambona yuko hapa na tuko na wasini ya pasta. Nyakati zao zikifika, watasimama, tutasikia sauti zao, watasema uh, pamoja nasi. Sasa hivi, nataka kumpisha Ken, aweze kuelekeza kipindi kuanzia hapa. Ken. Uh, wapenzi wa Bwana Hamjambo Happy Sabbath Harusi tunayo Harusi tunayo Asante tunashukuru Mungu kwa ajili ya wakati huu uh, kwa wakati tungeweza kuweza kuanza uh, utaratibu wa harusi na tutakuwa na just a small matching kwa ajili ya kukaribisha maharusi kwa njia kipekee ningeomba wote tuweze uh, kutulia tuweza watulivu tuvumiliane ili tuweze kumaliza kipindi hiki kwa kumtukuza Mungu wetu. Uh, pale nyuma uh, kutakuwa na vikundi vitatu uh, mbili hivi ama ya kumatch pathfinder wataingia pia tutafuata na maharusi uh, kulingana na utaratibu uliopo. Uh, kwa sasa ningeomba mchezaji Kinanda kwa ajili ya kuweza kukaribisha na kutayarisha kikundi cha kwanza Ningeomba matu unaweze kuingia ndani kwa taratibu ili Pathfinder wawe tayari kuingia ndani na sehemu hiyo. Matu tafadhali naomba muweze kuingia kwa haraka ili Pathfinder waweze kuja na kukata, kukata ribbon na waweze kupata pia na fasi. Karibu. Uh, Nona kwanza pale tayari slow marching uh, ni kataji wa ribbon Hapo tayari pale pathfinder Asante sana uh, For that matching Madrid, 
kuyakalia kwa karibu katika kifua chao kimali kwa langata SDA Church au Matron C ya Matrons kuyakalia kwa mwingine katika waskari kwa Samoe Mishina na mama mkugwa kwa mtambua melia Oliech karibu sana thank you for the wonderful matching thank you for the wonderful matching Asanteni sana na nikiona pale kuna wale wanaobeba Biblia karibu sana na kitabu cha nyimbo karibu sana na zaidi ya yote kuna pillows ambayo itatumika katika huduma hii ya ndoa takatifu so much the best couple the best couple tafadhali nitaomba the best lady kutoka kule nyuma na the best man kutoka hapa mbele waweze kutembea kwa utaratibu ili waweze kutana hapo kwa ajili ya sherehe hii thank you so much na ningeomba tuweze kuketi tu wote ili tuweze kuwa na utaratibu kwa sababu tuko katika ibada
Thank you so much. Wonderful smile. Beautiful. Wow, beautiful. Say my amen. Amen. The best couple, the Eric Osekos family. Kwanjia unyekevu, kwanjia utaratibu, tunaomba ya kwamba, bi arusi, aweze kusindikishwa, kuja katika kanisa, akiwa pamoja na wazazi wake, karibuni sana. Bi arusi karibu, tunawakaribisha katika uh, kikao hiki. Wazazi, aweze kusindikisha, alafu pia, Bwana Arusi akiwa uh, tayari atasimama aweze kuteremka apokelewe na wazazi wake uh, hapa chini kidogo ili wakutane huko mbele pale katikati Thank you so much. Uh, uh, now, bigger uh, instruments here, ni kikundi maalum na hivi sasa wana chesa kwa jili ya kumuleta bi arusi. Santeni sana. Thank you so much. Wana arusi na upa kwenye mkevu. Weza kuteremka chini, kuterepokelewe na wazazi. Uh, Kwenye jukua hapa chini, ili mweza kuenda kupokea B. Arusi. Thank you so much. God bless you. God bless us all as we witness this uh, wonderful ceremony. Thank you. Ningeomba bwana na bi, uh, bi, bwana harusi waweze kutembea pia kwa taratibu wakutane pale katikati mahali uh, uh, best couple wako thank you so much Thank you so much. Naona wanatembea kwa utaratibu wakisindikishwa bwana harusi na bi harusi wako kwa njia ya kuunganishwa katika hii ndoa takatifu. Asante sana naomba mchungaji Wow wow naomba sasa tutulie Naomba kinanda tutulie Post the music as I ask this question Who will give this woman to be married to this man If you are there you raise up your hand and you will speak out your name Yes, give him a mic, let him say his name. Ni mimi Bwana Nabi Benson Nyangi Nyankana. Dio ni napeana Rexavin. Mungese maje kanisa. Sasa naomba upate kusonga kidogo, ukaachirie uo mukono, ukamukabithi mwenyewe. 
Tuone kama atashika ama atashika. Anasogea pale kwa utaratibu tena kwa uoga kidogo. Uh, of course this is hii ni kawaida duk duk. Um, moyo unapiga sana kama kungekuwa na nasi pale angepima e, lakini ili kwamba atulie naomba upige hatua kidogo bwana harusi ukaone kama unayepewa ni yeye wa kukuncha hiyo veil na uangaze macho yako unaambie kama ni yeye ama si yeye mpe mic ni yeye ah mungesemaje haya kamata yeye kwa mkono wa kushoto we unakaa um, you put her on the on the left is this left akae kwa left yako shika yeye na usiachilie unileete hapa kwa utaratibu kabisa and the music can one, now one, two. play uh, yes instruments we continue playing thank you Naomba wapite sasa wanaka hapa ama kule mlipangaje wale matron matrons where you show them where to sit the opposite it's opposite achilia wanaka hapa ni ndani ama ni nje okay kaa ka hapa na mwingine hapa arafu paste kapo pia the same we Aileen shikiria huyo fuatia fuatana na yeye fuatana na yeye ulete mpaka hapa eh alafu unachunga kutoka nje eh wengine huwa wanakaa nyuma lakini we naona utakaa sambamba that is best mungeja mungesemaje karusi karibu itakamilika na ngojea daktari amalize matching ndio wa kufunga Arafu nitangaze maneno. Oh. 
Okay. Um, Naomba mketi, naomba mketi. Uh, nimepewa Biblia hapa. Nataka niitumie isiende kwamba ilikuja tu. Somee fungu moja, kila sija sungu, sija soma. Ninaomba kuwakaribisha kila mmoja aliyepata nafasi kufika. Mungu awabariki sana. Kwa utulivu wenu Mungu awabariki sana. Kwa ya Mungu awabariki sana. You are sparkling like you are the one doing the wedding. In fact when I came niliona Tito hapa na Elder Moin nikafikiri vingine. Sasa <laughs> sasa nimekuja nikaona kumbe ni uniform ya choir but it is very spectacular. Pelia you look good. <laughs> you look good, you are good. Watoto wa Mungu tunapokuwa katika hali hii ni hali ya furaha ni hali ambayo e, kila mtu anaitamani na kila mzazi pia anaombea watoto wake waipitie na sasa hawa wanapofikia hali hii tunamtukuza Mungu tena wanaifanya siku ya sabato hii ndio itakuwa takatifu sana na hebu niwaambie rafiki zangu kufikia hapa tunapokwenda kusoma those vows na ku exchange those vows na kuomba hiyo ndiyo arusi yani tutatangaza kwamba amepatikana mke na amepatikana mume na tukiambia Mungu sasa wabariki arusi inaishia hapo na kufikia hapo arusi si ati ni ya gharama sana kwa hivyo vijana wetu naomba kuwatia moyo Munapokuwa katika hali ya kutafuta tafuta e, maishirio hebu ni kuhakikishie kwamba uwezi kuparikiwa upate pesa utajirike na una mke na una bwana unajisumbua bure unapokuwa na kakazi kako kidogo kabarua kidogo ukitaka kuwa na pesa nyingi oa ama uolewe Uziseme ngoja niweke itoshe haitatosha hakuna kijana anaweza kuwa tajiri We angalia ni nani amekuwa tajiri unless ni mwizi <laughs> Vijana wote wanabarikiwa wakipata mke sasa huyu kijana yangu anakwenda kuwa tajiri kwa sababu ya Alexa Vin And this is biblical. Mtu anabarikiwa kwa sababu ya ya mke. Biblia inasema medhali 18 uh, fungu la 22 inasema kwamba apataye mke upata kitu. Alafu tena upata nani kutoka kwa Mungu? Neema, fever, rehema. Yaani anapata ile fever ukiangalia vizuri inakuwa sasa ni miparaka in totality ile ndiyo sasa ufunguo na kwa sababu umepata funguo ya utajiri tunza utajiri wako na utunze funguo yako ungekufa masikini kama sio huyu msichana kwa hivyo kwa sababu umepata kitu cha tunu tunza kwa jina la Yesu Shikiria kabisa usifike mahali useme sasa nimekinai a a kila siku una renew upendo wako una renew kumchumbia you seduce her every morning haleluya ukitaka ta, uta, ukitaka utajiri una seduce yeye kila asubuhi ukitaka utaji ukitaka kufa masikini We kondoa macho useme mimi ni mwanaume. Unajua uwezi kwa sababu wakati Mungu alipomuona Adam kabla ya Rex vinya kija, alipomuona Osika, alisema aje. Si vyema. Osika akae hivi peke yake. 
akasema si vyema kwa nini alisema si vyema maana alimuona akiwa amekondeana akiwa misarebo akiwa mgonjwa 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 yani kuna unajua ugonjwa wengine hata ukienda hospitali uambiwe kuna ugonjwa unapewa panadol <laughs> sasa amepata panadol haleluya lexavir ndio panadol yako usinunue panadol tena manake manake unajua Mungu alisema nitakupatia wa kukusaidia sasa mtu wa kusaidiwa si ni disabled ni mtu ambaye ajiweze si ndio i mean uweze saidia mtu ambaye anajiweza unaweza milionea uwezi ako anafurahi uwezi sasa amekuja ufunguo wa mambo yako yote mbaraka huko hapa sasa kile kitu utafanya ni kimoja tu kinaitwa adjustment unazikia manake mnaanza sasa safari ya pamoja ile singleness ile attitude ya mimi ni single unaamka unatoka kama swara unajua swara mahali ya merara <laughs> ataangalia <laughs> sasa urazima uangalie useme ah mke wangu melalaje umeamkaje leo nasikia kula nini nikuje na nini arafu kwaheri sasa kwaheri si unajua hiyo ni nini zinikufundisha kwaheri arafu kija usije mkono mtubu kwa sababu mkono mtubu haifanywe nini hata udakuta na saka saka unajua saka saka ile uhuru park beba hata kama ni kanjugu ukifika nyumbani usikuje hivi mpatie hiyo 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 uhuru park kwanza kisha msalimie kisha mpige pusu kama mmesoana ni pusu sijui mtasoeana mtaambiana huwa tukikutana tunakutanaje hiyo ni adjustment una adjust kupokea arafu una adjust mentally kwamba i am not alone haleluya i have admitted somebody in my space huyu mtu anahitaji wakati wangu hello anahitaji pesa zangu haleluya anahitaji maombi yangu anahitaji upendo kutoka kwangu maana yake nimemkubali lazima iwe hivyo that adjustment will take you very far because you have decided to be married before god you know you are preaching a sermon you know that the sermon is that god is related to his church one he is the head of the church and number two he is working on the church to become blameless to become fit for himself sasa kazi ndio imeanza unapokwenda kusema nimekubali ukaitaja zile ahadi zote ndio safari imeanza na unajua ni kwa nini nakuambia hivi ni kwa sababu aliye aliyeumbwa kwanza ni mume. Si mnajua hivyo? Ubaya amjui sababu. Mnajua sababu? Mume gani anajua sababu aliumbwa kwanza? Eden. Ni kwa sababu Mungu alitambua huyu nitamweka awe the first among equals. Nielewe akamwambia nimekupatia shamba lima shamba tunza Unasikia Sasa shamba si ni hili Ulifanye liwe fit Arafu zaidi akampatia nini position ya mwalimu akamfanya akamwambia hapa nina matunda 
ya miti mitatu lakini ya katikati usifanya nini usijaribu Awa hakuwa pale desk savini hakuwa pale sasa ikawa kwamba huyu ni instructor huyu tena ni mwalimu huyu tena ni head of the spiritual department he is the chief priest sasa wale ambao tuko katika ndoa wazee ambao hatujatambua hilo tambueni mi mi baraka yote inatoka kupitia kwako mbona bibili nasema um, petro wa kwanza tatu saba inasema mwanaume akae na mwanamke kwa akili kama chombo kisicho kipki chombo kinyonge ili maombi yake yasije yakafanya nini yakazuiliwa meaning every man who was married your family depends on you for blessings if you don't lift up holy hands and pray for your wife and children and your endeavors wewe ni mchoyo sana Yaani umefunga mibaraka. Si mama more than the man. It is the man. Mbona mchasema, amchasoma Saburi 128 mkajua fungu la kwanza na la pili linalosema kwamba mwanamume aliyebarikiwa ni wakumucha Mungu. Na ameasema pale kwamba ukimcha Mungu ufanye vile nimesema sasa wewe cha, utakula chasho la mikono yako kwa furaha na mke wako atakuwa sasa ndiyo mibaraka she cannot be if you ignore that ingredient you can't many families have a problem and the problem is because men have absconded from their duties they cannot function the way god meant them to function and that's why they are living in marriages in pretense they are living like trophy husbands and a trophy wife inaansia na uhusiano na Mungu na sio uhusiano wa kuonyesha ni uhusiano wa karibu sana wa kutoka moyo ndio maana tumeimba Yesu akiwa wapi nyumbani atakujaje katika nyumba ambapo kuna makelele ambapo kuna kuna skimming ambapo watu wanakaa pamoja lakini mioyo yao imetengana they are emotionally divorced psychologically divorced we must revisit our vows when you say i will cherish you i will uphold you you alone that makes the spouse your project sasa usikize Alex Savin when you come to the sin and you find this man God gives you a divination he says you are a helper how can you be a helper of someone you don't know someone you don't communicate Paul anasema wives respect your husbands in the lord it is not to fear husbands don't, don't accept a wife to fear you because then he will not help you mpe kitoe kwake akusome kama kitabu usianze kupiga kona huyu amepewa amepewa mamlaka na Mungu akuchunge wewe 
akuuliza maswali unaenda wapi unaenda wapi na hebu jibu madam <laughs> nitatoka hapa nipande hii gari nini matatu alafu nitafika taoni nitaona fulani alafu by 2 i'll be back sasa ukirudi after 2 usishangae akikuuliza mbona umecherewa usiseme mimi si mtoto ah wewe ni mtoto wake he pipilia kama ningekuwa na wakati ningewasema pipilia nasema Mungu ameumba chambo chipia mwanamke atamlinda mwanaume sasa fadhali wewe umepewa wa kukulinda kuna wanaume hawana sasa kwa sababu hawana wa kuwalinda wameumia sana wamekuwa na accident mingi mwanake awalinde huyu ndio ndio polisi wako ndio army officer wako anachunga wewe kila unakula anachunga na anaonja kwanza ili usiwekewe sumu ana anaangalia sema hiki chakula kifai <laughs> kwa hivyo hata yeye lazima ajue chakula kinachofaa unajua atangia sasa tutaanza kuona kitambi kikitoka usione kwamba <laughs> lazima kitoke wacha hii unatembea kama unataka kupelekwa na upepo itatokea kwa jina la Yesu si Samson yuko hapa <laughs> and Samson yako hapa leo ayuko Yuko wapi? Samson nisalimie. Ayuko ndani. Lakini mkimuona, <laughs> luka wapi? Samson tokea tokea. To, tokezea kuja pande hii. Si mnamuona? Alikuwa namna hii? Si ndio nakwambia mwanamke ni dawa. Mwanamke ni dawa. Haleluya. Na ni mpaka tuwaheshimu ni mpaka tuwatolee kila kitu kwa mifuko manake kazi yenu wanawake ni kupokewa ni kupewa hata kama anafanya kazi mpatie pesa haleluya ukija nyumbani usimwambie ile yako ulipeleka wapi ya mama aiesabiwi patia ye umwambie ile si unajua mshahara wangu ni nalipo andi huu alafu ndiye atapanga vizuri ukianza kumfinya finya atakufinya pia tena atakufinya kwa afya utaseeka mapema si unaona vile sisi tunakaa sisi tuliachilia sisi tuliachilia <laughs> na ukiachilia mapema unaishi miaka <laughs> unaishi miaka <laughs> na miaka ya furaha kabisa <laughs> Mungu wa mbinguni awabariki sana Sasa unajua tumeleta hawa wili tuwaombe ili sasa tutangaze wamekuwa kitu kimoja mwili mmoja tena si wawili na hakuna njia unaweza kuwatenganisha wewe na mshene mshene yote iishie hapa kwa jina la Yesu Manaka nilitangaza 21 days hakuna mtu ameleta mshene. Sasa muzilete mshene tena. Hawa sasa ni maombi. Ndio maana wamekuja mbele za Mungu. Wanatakuwa watatu, eh, saa ni watatu, Mungu, eh, Oscar, Lexavin wakiungana wanakuwa ni moja pamoja na Mungu wawili. Na Mungu anakataa mambo ya divorce. Umezikia? Siku hizi wasichana wadogo kama nyinyi mulienda university mukasoma. Umeenda university wewe? Wasichana hawa wanakuwa ni pilipili sana. They are not informed. Wakiona kitu kidogo tu wanasema I will leave you. Mimi nitaenda niishi peke yangu, niishi peke yangu, manake nina pesa, nina nini, kwani unaniletea nini? Arabu wanasindikizwa na maneno na wanawake walioacha wa mabwana zao na wengine wame divorce emotionally, wanawaambia mtu asikuchezea, asikuletee. Ati asikuletee. Eh, unaweza ishi, si unaona mimi naishi mimi. Usipae hiyo, anaishi anateseka. Anataka wewe pia uungane na yeye muteseke pamoja. We tunza yako. Tunza yako kaa muke kaa mume haleluya kuna kuna mnyama yeyote duniani 
ambaye ana vichwa mbili mnyama kuna mtu ana kichwa mbili <laughs> iko sikira mtu anakuwa kitu, kichwa moja hii nyumba iko na kichwa moja unazikia reserve kichwa moja na kichwa ya bibilia ni gani si unajua na wewe ushikirie hiyo neck usianze hii mbitu inaitwa inaitwa feminism yeah sianze hizo rayot ninajua hii familia itakuwa the example that Jesus said his relationship with the church this is your head and your support sawa sawa asante Mungu awabariki sana nataka sasa ni wape authority ya ku exercise haya maneno kwa jina la Yesu <laughs> Bwana Yesu asifiwe <laughs> I give you the authority give me the the where did you put oh it is here Okay. Mutasimama. Wapi ngine? This is good. You look fantastic. You have changed overnight. Bado na mambo bado safari ndio hii. Sasa I will administer the vows. You will do yours. Oh, you have you have it. So um, are you ready? Umesikia kitu ambacho kinafanya useme wacha tuache hapa. Uko tayari? Acha tuanze. Mwanaume uko tayari? You are ready? Yes. Chukua hiyo mic. Sasa unajua unaingia na utoki. <laughs> Kutoka ni saa hii. <laughs> saa hii kabla ya hii. Uki, ukiingia hii ukimaliza hiyo basi mbingu imeweka saa hii na sisi tutaweka saa hii baadaye na ni mwisho ukiingia kwa nyumba upate kuna shimo hapa kwa kwa mgongo shimo kubwa wewe vumilia usileta useme nimepata shimo unaendelea na hiyo shimo ni yako haya chukua hiyo karatasi <laughs> soma we are taking the vows, please. Now let's um, let's listen to the where we are really going. Before God and in the presence of these witnesses, I, Oscar Kambona, take you, Rexavin Owino, to be my one and only wife, to have and to hold from this day forward for better, for us for richer, for poor, in sickness and in health, to love and to cherish from this day forward until, until death do us apart. I will cherish our union and love you and cry with you, loving you faithfully through good and bad times, regardless of the obstacles we may face together. I give you my hand and my heart and my love from this day forward for as long as we shall both live. This is my song bow. Amen. Amen. How does it feel? Before God and these witnesses, I, Rexavin Adhiambo Owino, take you Oscar Kambona Alo, to be my one and only husband, to have and to hold from this day forward, for better, for worse, for richer, for poorer, in sickness and in health, to love and to cherish from this day forward until death do us part. I will cherish our union and love you and cry with you, loving you faithfully through good times and bad times, regardless of the obstacles we may face, uh, together, I give you my hand, my heart, and my love from this day forward for as long as we shall both live. 
this is my solemn vow to you. Move forward and join hands. Move forward and um, join hands. For as much as Oscar Kwambona Alo and Lexavin Adhiambo Owino have consented to be joined together into a holy matrimony and have witnessed the same before God and his company and thereto have given and pledged their truth each to the other and have declared the same by joining hands. I as a minister of the gospel and the authority of the law of the Republic of Kenya, do pronounce that they are a husband and a wife. Yeah. What God had joined together, let no man or woman put asunder. Uh, we shall now uh, proceed to pray that uh, the Almighty God will bless this union and will lead them step by step in their married life and they will prosper in Jesus' name. Amen. They will also have siblings, yeah, children in Jesus' name, Amen. both male and female. Amen. And they will serve God in happiness. They will also make money in the mighty name of Jesus. Amen. They will be rich in Jesus' name. Amen. And from now, this day forward, they will not be separated even one inch in the mighty name of Jesus. Amen. Let us kneel down and pray as I pray. May you also pray um, together. Don't leave the hands. Keep the hands together. Go down on your knees. Is uh, any pastor around here to assist me? Prayers. Oh, Pastor Koja. I'll pray and that you will pray. We'll kneel down. Uh, give, him the knee. give him also the mic. Ay, ay, ay. Ay, ay, ay. Ata mimi nitafanya hii arusti. Naona kama nito. Naona kama lita. Hii ni utamu sana. Tuombe. Mutakatifu mungu wetu na baba wetu. Mipango yako ni ajabu ni, ni, ya, ni kamilifu. Kwa wakati wako umereta Alexa kivini pamoja na Oscar ukawafanya muke na mume. Jina lako litukuzwe. Man. Sasa ni naomba uwepo wako katika union hii. Isipungue ya tatakika moja kwa jina la yesu. Wanapoanza nyumba hii mpya naomba ufanye kikao kwenye hiyo nyumba manake it is your family now take it up in Jesus name and lead them every step of the way as they start nav navigating a new life new experience new obstacles new opportunities make them successful in Jesus name Make them successful in Jesus' name. Amen. Make them a complete example of your union and the church in Jesus' name. Amen. Let everybody know that this is all you need to make a home run under your guidance. That we welcome you and you stay in our family now and forever. Our Father and our God, give wisdom to the head of this home, Pastor Oscar Kambona. Let him lead his family and show the example of leadership in his home. Amen. Help him to make his wife feel at home in the mighty name of Jesus. Let the wife know that now she has a husband who cares, a husband who is concerned, a husband who will lead her to heaven in the mighty name of Jesus. Amen. And now I pray that Lex Savin will be the helper that you planned her to become. Let her be the wise wife of Proverbs chapter 31, from 10 to 31. Amen. 
Let her know when her husband should eat and what he should eat. Let her know that for the husband to function well, he must be satisfied right from the stomach. Have, help her to have a good hygiene habits. Let her, their home be a home where angels will make company at any time. Help this couple because they have fronted you, because they have done it according to your will. Depart not from their lives in Jesus' name. Amen. When you bless them with money, as you bless them with good life and a good health, bless them with children in Jesus' name. Give them males, give them females, and make them what you intend them to become for the glory of your holy name. As pastor continues in this prayer, I crown them and cover them with the blood of Jesus Christ. From now as they walk out of this sanctuary, may your presence never depart from them. May your favor accompany them. May your blessings be abundant in their lives. Amen. What they miss, bring it, dear Lord, because they have done this for you. Thank you for hearing. Thank you for answering. Thank you for this crowd. Thank you for these witnesses. Thank you for their, their, their prayers. And now as we proceed with this prayer, hear and answer them, we pray in Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. Bwana, kwa kuwa umeona ni viema kwa unganisha wawili hawa. Kwa neno la mtumishi wako na kwa maagizo yako. Na kwa kuwa wameiti sauti yako. Ninaomba kristo sasa. Bwana uwashika manishe wawe kitu kimoja. Leta amani katika ndoa yao. Bariki uzao wao. Kemea na kuwaepusha na vishawishi. Endelea kristo amani kufungua milango ya baraka kwa ajili yao. Na wakawe mfano bora katika jamii, katika kanisa. Watakapokuwa wakiwaona na wale wanao waudumia, wakakuone kupitia ndoa yao. Asante yesu kwa kuwa imani yangu ni kwamba umesikia maombi haya. Na kwa imani utajibu na kutenda kwa jina la Yesu Kristo amina. Amina haleluya sasa simama. Simamisha yeye, simamisha yeye. Shika yeye aravu pereke yeye pale we njoo hapa sasa. E, njoo hapa kwa mke wako enda huko. Enda huko. Enda pamoja. Usiachilie. Shikilia, shikilia. shikilia. Sasa unajua umepewa. Sasa kaa na mke wako sasa hapa. Na we kaa na wako huko. Unajua nakaa mkono huo milele na milele. Sasa tunataka kufanya signing of the certificates. I don't know where they where do we sign from? Where? I don't know what we go oh okay. Sijui ni nini taendelea tunapo sign. Um muta mutapiga miziki eh. Eh mnaonekana mzuri hata nyinyi. Uh, as the couples are signing, uh, we wish the, our grandchildren of Langata SG Church waweze kucheza wimbo moja. Wakati uo pia kanisa la kwaya kanisa la Langata SG Church, nitoomba mweze kwa tayari. Wanapo maliza, that special item, and then Langata SG Church will sing also.
Thank you so much. Thank you so much, the instruments, for the wonderful violin uh, tones. Okay, um, as the choir sings, I would like to Yes, um, nataka, nataka ni malize hii kwa kuwaletea uh, a new couple in town. The newest couple in town. Mr. and Mrs. Oscar. Kambona, alo. Wangapi wanapokea? And uh, I want to give them now their marriage certificate I will give it to the lady so that she will start now being a helper and let's watch and see whether she has the wisdom of Proverbs 14 1 <laughs> right did you take a fit a foot of that right right let's see how she will uh, keep it because in my in the village where I come from they call women a very special name the ones who keep things translation of in a, in a Nataka muone muone kane kwa picha. Hivyo sasa. Na mimi nitoe hapa. Niangalie wanavyofanya. <laughs> Tena naiweka wapi? Anaiweka karibu na moyo. Huyu <laughs> ni mkreva huyu. Hataki mchezo. Basi tena amefunga. Mngesemaje? Aya, hizi mbili, moja itaenda ofisi, nyingine itaenda AG. I, I don't know, uh, Pestman, how do we do it? You take care of this. Make sure they are in the various uh, positions, because these days they are very, very strict. Very strict, they check. If I don't return them, my license will be cancelled. Now, Simungu wa san. Waja tusikie kwaya, aravu tukule ugali, kila mutu waenda nyumbani. Asante, sante sana mchungaji, marusi wanapoketi chini, kwaya ya familia, this is a special song they are going to sing, naomba waweze kuimba kwa haraka, and then kwaya ya langata ya kanisa, and ka, eh, kwaya ya kanisa ya langata, waweze kuwa tayari kwa wimbo.
Amen. Praise God. Kwaya langata. SDG kwaya kanisa. Tafadhali. Mchukue na fasi enu. Praise God. Thank you so much. Uh, uh, Marusi, wanapo, uh, endelea, kujianda, tungependa tuweze kuondoka, na tutondoka kwa utaratibu huu. 
the new couple in town uh, watatangulia na watakapotangulia watafuatwa na the best couple and then the rest waweze kufuata baadaye kwa hiyo tafadhali ningeomba wote tuweze kutiketi kwa utaratibu wakati bwana na bibi harusi wanapotoka katika kanisa wakienda pale nje na tukifika pale nje kuna mamkuli chakula kimandaliwa kidogo ili tuweze kukula zote tutakaa kwa utaratibu na tuweze kufanya kwa upesi ili tuweze kufanya mkutano ambao unastahili kuendelea baadaye Mungu azidi kuwabariki maharusi naomba tafadhali mweze kusimama mweze kuondoka kupigwa picha akiwa na mama mchungaji senior senior anapata picha baada ya kwa msani thank you so much thank you so much thank you thank you Stairs, it's all from